Salutations everyone, today we're going to start playing a game called Mega Man Unlimited. So I'm sure there are probably some of you out there who are waiting for Battle Kid 2, Cooper wins Battle Kid 2, going to start being done. And I'm still trying to figure out how I'm going to record all that with the audio and all that stuff. Uh, so that's still on hold for now. So uh, And we only have not too much longer until Pokemon X and Y. We've got like about a month to go as of this posting. Um, so we're pretty excited for that, and that'll certainly be... Lot of stuff up with that. Um, so until then, we're going to fill the time with this game, which has been in development for quite a long time, I believe. Actually, uh, the author is Megathil X. Um, I used to keep up with updates on this back several years ago, but uh, it kind of fell off. But now uh, it is complete. It was completed a month or two ago. I don't know. Um, anyway, I've heard this game is extremely hard. Um, this will be a blind playthrough. I've never played this game before, so. Uh, we're gonna see how badly this game kicks my butt. Um, I do not expect. We're probably not gonna have nice little like, oh, each episode's gonna be one robot master or anything like that. We're just gonna be um, playing until I get tired of playing for that part, I guess. So anyway, let's uh, start everything up here. Mega Man Unlimited. We're gonna try to move this into angle. I'll fix it more better. More better. Momentarily, we see people's names. 25th anniversary of Mega Man. I still need to play uh, Street Fighter versus Mega Man 2. This is not an official Mega Man game. It was originally called Mega Man 10, I believe, until Capcom actually made an actual Mega Man 10. So in the year 2000XX, Mega Man managed to preserve world peace by defeating the evil Dr. Wily for at least uh, 11 times, right? At least. And of course there's going to be explosions in, in the city. Eight robots has to be eight. Yeah, you know, I mean you don't really need a good plot for Mega Man games. It's just robots stuff yeah, show up, start blowing stuff up. Yeah, yeah. Doctor Wily uh, gives us some lip service. <laughs> don't you guys love Doctor Light's beard? So similar to Mega Man 3, Dr. Wily claims he wants to work. <laughs> it seems he was sincere for once. Apparently there's no period after the the doctor. Alright, so we got NES style graphics. Some other four. Cause, well, or this is like the uh, the evil energy uh, duo fights against a Mega Man 8. Also, Dr. Wily is like a pixel or two taller than Dr. Light, and that was ostensibly Bass, or uh, <laughs> or Bass as I'm pretty sure he's supposed to be pronounced, but we pronounce him Bass on this channel because it sounds cooler, and that's pretty much the only reason actually. That and the whole Mega Man 8 thing, but anyway. Hmm. Well, it definitely looked exactly like uh, Bass's Dash Sprite from Mega Man 10. Uh, but anyway, we are playing version 1.1.0. I heard this game was so hard that uh, the creator had to come out with a easy mode version. And are we actually... This looks okay. Hopefully there's not black lines anywhere. I don't know how I moved it because everything was black. Um, hopefully things are good though. Alright, so we gotta set up controls. Options, display size, uh, controller inputs. All right up. Oh no, is my controller working? Should be. One moment, guys. All right, let's see if this works now. Up, down, there we go. Left, right. Um, we're gonna go B for jump. B for jump. B for jump. Okay. Um. Apparently we're going to be going X and Y for jump or slide. Um, I guess L. Next weapon, I guess that would be, be R. Why are B, Y and B not working? Alright, for, so for some unknown reason, Y and B are not working. So I guess we'll just do that then. And neither... Why are, why are half my buttons not working? Okay. Alright guys, so for some reason, uh, the default making of the map controller inputs does not want to work 
with my start, select, Y, and B buttons on my Super Nintendo controller. Um, I It works with X, A, L, L and R in the D-pad, so I don't know what's up with that. So we're just going to use jo a joy to key instead. And yeah, so we're going to go with that. I already tapped this in off, cam off, uh, off screen. So I guess we want to slide with down and jump. That's probably the way we're going to slide. Um, I can also slide with A. So hopefully all this works. All right, let's start a new game. Okay, so we have three difficulty modes. I believe uh, these two were added in the update. Easy because people thought the game was too hard. Uh, and insta death. That is very appealing to me because, you know, I want to be the god of battle kit stuff. But we're going to play easy. We're going to have a health bar. Um, Alright, so here here's our... What is select? So we're selected. Oh, is my enjoy the key selected? Yes, yes it is. We move stuff. Maybe I don't have any screws. That's why I can't access the. I'm assuming that's like the shop or something. Um, anyway, so we have Rainbow Man, Comet Wool Man, Yo Yo Man, Blue Man, Nail Man, <laughs> Tank Man, Jet Man, and Tri Nitro Man. Probably like TNT, right? Um, I, oh, what is what does Select do? Oh, select loads stuff up. What is... what? Alright, so episode one is going to be called Controller Fail, apparently. Um, I can't push... Uh, even Joy to Key is not working with me now. Shift is apparently is the menu. But, uh... For some reason, select is not working. So that's bizarre. Um, anyway, we're going to get started. We've already wasted, I forget how long. Uh, we're going to go in Glue Man's... We're going to go Glue Man first. Got uh, charged shots being fired around in the background. <laughs> Alright, so in the background there's stuff gripping down. And we're gonna make sure controls are proper. Okay, here we got Yoku. Okay. okay. Does select do anything important? Okay, no, not really. It just brings up system menu. Uh, so that's fine then. Why does this also shoot? I don't think this is also supposed to shoot. Okay, so I already have compromised some of the blind portions of this by controller fails. But anyway, uh, hopefully we have stuff working properly now. I had to use Joy to Key to um, make things work less stupidly. Okay, now Select works. Wasn't working before, but oh well. Um, hopefully we have everything working now. I had to like make, like, delete the old extraction and make a new one. But anyway, we are in Glue Man stage. And hopefully we'll have smooth sailing technical-wise from here on out, even though we're going to get our butt kicked by the game as it, as it is anyway. Um, pretty good. Uh, I'm actually going to do one thing really quick. Alright, hopefully that is the last interruption we have. Um, so... Oh, snap, there's Mets on top of Mets. And okay, can we charge? It looks like we can't charge, so it's going to be... Jump and shoot man, no charge and shoot man. Let me scroll back on the screens. Uh, but we can... Ooh, ladders. And this is... Glue, okay, that's... <laughs> can, you, can you slide? Can you slide through the glue? Nope, that's not about it. Oh man, they, oh wow, bullets stick to him, you guys see that? Oh, but he, he does die, okay. Oh, there are screws, okay. I gotta get up, I gotta get up, uh... Further, we get to a man. Yeah, the two there is the number of lives remaining, I guess. The stage. Okay, that's not too bad. Not too bad at all. Um, yes, we can slide. Okay, so Cayman would be happy. Oh snap! A little delay on the jump there, right there. Okay, I should... Oh, wait. The keys is respawning on the screen. That would be... Ah, oh, this is the time where I wish I had charge shot. Ooh, got lucky there. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, the, this glue on the floor is really messing with my mind. Okay, good. Shots still go through walls. Snap. So... And we have a 
Crash Core. Oh, yes, we do. Okay. Nice big screw there. Is that an H? I don't know if that does anything. Probably not. So, yeah, so I, li I like this enemy that the, uh, the bullets stick to him. It's pretty neat. Oh no. Okay, well the good thing is we only have to dodge the uh, the lower one, right? Actually, we can just slide under it if we want to. Yeah. Oh. Uh, get some more Rush Coil back. Can we shoot this guy? Nope. Okay, he's one of the... He's one of the crawler dudes. How do we, we get on top of here? Oh, okay. It's like a magnet. I was gonna say, we need to do like a Gravity Man stage or something like that. We need some health pickups. More glue. Don't wanna fall, don't wanna fall. Oh, oh this is gonna make quick hops because the magnet's gonna carry you back, right? Oh, the Metars. angles. Okay, maybe we want to rush goal there. I was about dead anyway. Uh, did we get to a continue point? No, this is like the start of leveling up. Okay. Right, so we got pretty far though. No continue point though. Right, hopefully we won't get hit as many times. This attempt. We still keep our screws and stuff, right? Yes, 22. I like these enemies. One's the glue, glue in the base, and the bullets stick to him. It's so funny. This is the tower. Can't slide on the glue, unfortunately. I guess that would sort of defeat the purpose of the glue, which is to prevent you from moving left and right unless you're in the air. This guy. I think we're probably better off just staying... Um... Thing on the glue because otherwise we run the risk of scrolling him back on the screen and replenishing his health and that is not what we want. Oh, there's a health pickup. Can we get it? Can we get it? Yes we can. And avoid taking too much damage. Okay. Uh, rapid fire on this guy. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, I don't know if that was, if that was a graphical glitch or what, but uh, while my bullets were stuck to him, Mega Man was stuck in... Yeah, like that, or not like that right there. Oh, that's, that's convenient. Um, Mega Man looked like he was stuck in the, uh... Yeah, that pose. You guys ever done that pose in real life? It's pretty fun. Getting better, getting better at these guys maybe a little bit. Oh, stop firing your stuff as soon as I want to jump. All right, back to full life. Take the magnet, the magnet train over. Not get hit by that guy. Blue, beating our progress. Go this guy. Get hit by this guy. Short hops, short hops. Smash Brothers brawl. Right, so here we're gonna use we're gonna use Rush Coil to take this. Oh, Rush. No, 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 no. You don't understand. I want you... Oh, the glue. Yeah, so this glue really messes up your jumps, too. You know, like, you're used to, um... Like, you're right here, right? And you make a little... You know, you ho you're used to, like, moving a little bit before your jump. Even though, like, I know the glue's there. It's, it's weird. we call that guy? The enemies probably have names, but they're probably not going to be revealed in the credits and stuff. I guess the nice thing about the tower mets is that after they fire once, they appear to not really do anything. I 
Yeah, enemies like that are why I love having charge shot. Enemies who have limited open vulnerability time. We're gonna get hit by the bullet there. This guy. Yeah, it's really convenient how he ricochets it right into the other enemy. It's kind of cool. <sighs> gonna make precision hops. Precision hops. We'll just try this stage again. Since we are uh, being enamored by the glue mechanic. a little bit better. We didn't really need that health pickup. Uh, where's my charge shot? Gonna have to get over that. Oh. It's gonna be fancy and slide right there, but uh, it's not a possibility. Oh. Did they fire an extra shot? Yeah, so as we know, Cooper is really bad at firing and jumping like at the same time properly you know I like to do like that's why I like the charge shot I just have to hold it and then release it at the right time instead of trying to release multiple shots at the same time or you know <laughs> trying to spam shots while in midair at the proper altitude not exactly my forte and yeah so he looked like he was uh oh maybe that's because the bullets were on screen I was still tapping fire that could be why. Alright, fortunately that guy does not have very many hit points for being such a large enemy. Alright, there's a green guy coming up. Let's kill him. Please. Oh no, I was gonna try to drop on the little platform there and maybe avoid getting hit by that guy, but that's not what we wanted to do at all. There we go, that's the slide I wanted to do. Yeah, there is a very slight controller lag, probably because I'm using Joy to Key, but it's, it's not so bad as to make the game unplayable, so it should be alright. If does become a problem, then I guess I can attempt to use the uh, default, the in-game mapping again. But um, kind of have to do so much editing on this video. I was resolving uh, technical crap. Yeah, so the... Okay. Um... So the tower mitts are somewhat odd. Um, yeah, for some reason, uh, the game does not recognize my controllers Y, B, start and select buttons and those are pretty big buttons when I'm playing Mega Man games. In fact I would argue those are the three, include the three most important buttons. Jumping, firing, and pausing to switch weapons. So yeah. It's kind of difficult to play without those. I mean I, I can use X and A, it's the same, oh crap, it's the same um, button figure button finger arrangement. But it's just not the same, you know? Feels more uh, wide thumb. Let's try not to die here. Good. There we go. Getting better with him. I'm, I'm assuming that's magnetics there, otherwise, like, there's a little hook going into Mega Man's head. So we're just gonna take the hit right there. Alright, this is what I wanted you to do for me, Rush. Okay, good. <laughs> I know in some of the games, 
Rush enjoys uh, not working, or some fan games anyway. Rush, whoa. Oh, okay, there's a thing up there. So we gotta be precise. Oh, crap. Precise stuff. You gotta make a, a low horizontally jump. Good stuff, good stuff. So yeah, I have no idea what the weakness weapon patterns and stuff are. No idea about that stuff. We'll just uh, find out as we go. And I know this game is modeled after, I believe, Mega Man 3, hence the no charge. Um, it does have slide. So... Three or two. I know two has um, some like like the uh, boss is not weak to this weapon, but it's you know like maybe like one weapon does five points of damage, but another one will do two or something like that. And I'm still sucking with these guys. Um, but yeah, you know three hat kind of has the instead of the one big cycle, it's got the five plus three, which is kind of neat. So I'll be interested to see which way this one goes. Let's just kill this guy. Yeah, I think it's because I keep tapping the button even when uh, I've already got three shots still on screen, technically. Which this, that guy could actually get really bothersome in conjunction with uh, other enemies on the screen. It's like, I need to shoot at these other enemies now. My bullets are trapped on the screen. So I could get pretty interesting for later stages. I'm expecting to see more of him in the Wily stages for sure. Assuming there are Wily stages. Impossible Doc Robot stages. Right, those guys actually hurt a lot. It's like three points. Oh crap. Here we go again, Rush. Hopefully those do not hit me. Good. So we gotta do a, uh... No, can't be a big jump. Yes, it's gotta be a short jump. Tricky jump right there, tricky jump. Oh, that's neat. <laughs> the shots are uh, ricocheting around. Let's see, we're gonna try a thing. Actually, I could use those over there. So we should probably... should pr probably actually get those. It's one of my uh, favorite sayings. Probably actually. And I missed Rush. Fantastic. Hopefully that's the continue point. Oh, never mind. We're just dead. Probably actually. How long have we been going on? Probably... Um, probably about, almost 20 minutes. We had, uh, probably at least four minutes of me messing around and failing at stuff. Uh, setup-wise, anyway. Which I may poss possibly edit at most, if not all, of it out. So, yeah, we may actually not get to Blue Man in this video. I would at least like to get to a continue point, though. That would be nice. Right, and these got this guy. All right. Phew. Good thing is we keep getting more screws. You know, probably about 50. 68, nice. Mice. No! Short hops. Do not want the long jumps. Long jumps. 
short jumps are needed. Bobby dude, getting hit. The guy's a lot easier when you don't have to jump and shoot him, so you can thereby simply have all your bullets hit him at the same spot and then dodge them all. This is much easier. I think this is another reason I'm better with Proto Man, because I can usually only ever fire off two shots per jump. At least on the, uh, that's the only two games where Proto Man's been playable, is uh, 9 and 10. And I believe he can only fire off uh, two shots on screen at a time. And we are already half dead. We're, we barely, oh, kill this guy off. Short hops, guys. Short hops. Oh, okay, we got a good, good bout there. Yes. Did that recover as much as they normally do? It seemed like it was a little bit less. It may be like one pixel or so. I don't know. Just seemed that way. So we're actually going to drop down here an attempt to not take contact damage from that guy, because he actually hits for a lot. Short hops. If the short hops look a little bit delayed, I don't know if it's because of the gluey surface or some possible controller lag. We'll see. Alright, nice. <laughs> nope. Stand be up there, Rush. See, when they're in positions like that, it's, it's much easier. Uh, it doesn't cost energy to summon them, right? Nope, only when you... Maybe we do have to just make this jump legit. <sighs> uh, I need to learn that if you get caught by that thing, wait until it's safe, and then fall down. Because there, there is the temptation to try to go ahead and, you know, oh, I'm far enough over, I, if, if I press A and fall down, I'll, I'll, I'll make it. But no, you won't make it. You have to clear it and... Oh, can we actually... Oh, okay, we don't want to do that, though. Pull some ammo. I'm going to there, since there's a life pickup. This guy, we gotta get better at this guy. We're taking way too many hits from him. Not terrible. Ooh. Free Mega Man head, as Xerxes would say. Yeah, I think that's what it is. It's just kind of funny to see the, uh... Ugh. Yeah, that jump is... Anytime you got a sandwich jump like that, it's pretty difficult. And this stage is full of sandwich jumps. Well, we will, uh, at least play out this life. And we'll move on, I guess, to our next part. Or should we? Should we have long parts for this, for these, this series? Um... I don't know. I'm probably gonna go ahead and film a lot of parts before I... Actually, I'm probably just gonna film this part. So, I don't know. Uh, those of you who watched the vids really early, I guess we'll get some say. And, uh, do you want to see super long parts? Or maybe I actually do beat the boss? Or do you want to see short parts? I'm gonna go with semi-short parts for now, like 20 minutes or so. It's gonna be the goal. 
part should be around, it should be 20 something minutes. So I'm hoping anyway. Oh, what have I done? Oh, okay. Oh, can you tell? Three points. Two pixels, maybe. Making small adjustments. That's what, that's the key. We're gonna try to focus more on offense on him, getting him down quicker. So those guys only take two hits to kill. So I'm gonna kill this guy, drop down, wait for the fire. Kill that guy. Short hops to the glue. Avoiding the ceiling. And we need to we need to we need to Mega Man up and stop using rush coil so much. But I really don't like how much damage these guys deal to me. Kill this guy. Just get to the edge. There we go, get to the edge. There we go. <sighs> you know what I should have done? I should have summoned Rush down there, so if I mess up the jump, uh, then Rush is down there to bail me out. Alright, so we're going to leave it here, guys. Uh, come back for episode 2 if you think you're going to enjoy more Cooper failing so bad. Uh, blind Mega Man Unlimited. Later days.